Saturday morning. Time for a quick run to the hardware store. Um, I need to get some little part metal guard on one of the power soccer chairs. So I'll have a total of three of them I'm bringing. One I'm using and two are going to be for other people to use. So uh, gonna run down to the hardware store and yeah get this going. I forgot my freaking wallet, so I have to go all the way back to the house now, get my wallet, and then all the way back to the hardware store. I realized I should probably explain myself a little bit. This whole power soccer thing is uh, basically the only competitive sport for people that use power wheelchairs. Um, I've played rugby before, or tried to. That's in manual chairs, but... Um, had issues there trying to find a chair that was the right size and then also it's a lot of work trying to push those things around but power soccer is great because pretty much anyone who can operate a power chair it's not nearly as rough as you might think I mean there's kids on ventilators that play what is this power soccer of which you speak and then I realized it involves strapping a giant guard on the front of your chair and running around and smashing into things oh and the chairs are programmed in such a way that if you don't use cooling fans they will overheat and catch fire so, to me, that sounded like something that I should probably do. So ever since then, we've been trying to get some teams set up uh, here in Portland. Uh, there's a few of them in Arizona. Yeah, it's kind of an uphill battle. These chairs aren't free, and most people or parents aren't going to, you know, want to use their everyday chair because you can potentially damage it and wear out stuff faster than you should. So the problem is trying to get linked up with an organization that is willing to support us and help us out with equipment and whatnot, and also pay for places for us to rent to practice. 150, 175 bucks to rent the gym for a few hours. So basically need to get partnered with some sort of organization that's gonna help us out with that stuff. Not everyone thinks that people are gonna be interested in this sport. Spend time and money, because they're not sure it's gonna take off. We're in Portland. This is where soccer lives. We're making tons of contacts with a bunch of different people and companies. Everywhere we go, everyone's super interested. Uh, we had a ton of people show up at the event, so I think now they understand that this might be a legitimate thing. I'm going to include a few links down in the description. Uh, GoPro's got a really good summary video of power soccer, so you can kind of get an idea of what's going on. But yeah, that's basically it. Um, I'm using my skills of destruction <laughs> to put some chairs together and try to have stuff available for people to use. So that's basically what's going on. So when you hear me talking about it, that's the story. Got all the stuff from the hardware store finally. So now I'm drilling some holes that I need to. Uh, there was a hole in this top part of the frame, but I needed it to go through the bottom. And uh, using the uh, plywood here to keep it from marring the amazing finish on this chair. But uh, yeah. Should have this done here in a little bit. We are all set to go. I got one of the chairs in here. That's the small chair. And then I've got two others over here. We've got this one here, which is the one I'll be using. I just put that one together. Got the, uh, the metal guard on that. And then this other one here will be another demo unit for somebody to use. This one also has a PVC pipe guard. Um, I'll put that on after we get there, but uh, yeah, going to be headed over there in a little bit and uh, hopefully we get a pretty good turnout.
Well, the event was highly successful. We had a ton of kids and other people showing up. And the best part is we actually showed the uh, company who's potentially going to be supporting us that there's a lot of interest in the sport. So, yeah, um, now we can move forward and uh, try to get some more monthly practices set up. And, uh, yeah, I think this should be a great thing.